Are we ready? Just making it up as I go. Welcome to another edition of Fit and Fire, your home for guns and gear and the fitness to run both. I'm Mark and I really appreciate you guys stopping by. So this episode, we're talking about different tools that you can find to help you speed load magazines, specifically for the AR-15 style magazine. Now, you may have seen a number of different companies out on the market today that are pulling together these loading boards. And these boards are nothing more than um, a flat piece of metal or polymer that you place a magazine in, you line up your magazines, and with a plunger, you push those rounds into the magazine. Well, I found a company while I was down at Tulsa for their annual gun show that has a really, really cool take on this loading board. And I'll show you what I mean right here. So this is the Yager PMC loading board. Now, this board um, is a little bit different than some of the other ones that are on the market today. First and foremost, this slot for your magazine, and I'll show you all the stuff on the B-roll here, this magazine slot is specifically designed for your polymer style magazines. Those polymer style magazines are your Magpul, your Lancer, or the Amen 2 magazines. And the reason for that is the cutout at the bottom allows for those magazines to sit in nice and neat. Some of the boards that are out on the market today don't have that cutout, so your magazine may be popped up a little bit. It still works, but it just kind of is a bit of a hassle because you have to use both hands to hold it down. This one you really don't have to. The other great feature that it has is it has this little device right here. This device slides in to the magazine well and what that is used for is for your GI style magazines. You can put this in there and that kind of takes up that extra room for you to use GI style magazines. Now this, this board is made of a very high grade dense polymer and then it is milled out from one solid piece. So you don't have to worry about multiple different pieces put together and then it falls apart on you. This board is all one piece milled out uh, from a very, very high grade polymer. And that's something I really appreciate it. I'll have a link to their website down below. It has the price to it. By all means, let them know that I, uh, I sent you there. They sure would appreciate it. The other product that I have is for when you are needing to load a magazine, but you went, and went out and bought bulk magazine, maybe thousand rounds of Lake City 556 or something to that effect and they come on these stripper clips right here. Now I'm very familiar with these stripper clips. Back in the day when I was in the military we would get bandoliers of 270 rounds on these stripper clips. The bandolier would come with this nice little device that would hook on to the back of the GI style magazine and then you would just slide this in and you push it down with your thumb or you turn it upside down and bang it against the table. That's all fine and well but what about the polymer mags? Those, those little devices don't fit those polymer mags very well. Well Yager PMC has this device right here. It's their speed loader and it's actually pretty cool. It's bigger than those other speed loaders that you would get with the bulk GI ammo. And the one thing that I really appreciate it is for one, it's huge so you can get a really good purchase on it with your hand. The next thing is the plunger on it has a magnet for the stripper clips. So as you insert the stripper clip into the speed loader, you just push down on the plunger and then as you pull that plunger out, the stripper clip comes out from the magnet. So that's a really, really cool feature. Again, I'll have a link down in the description below so you guys can go check it out yourself. Don't take my word for it. Go check it out. I hope you guys saw in the B-roll as a plane. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. As a plane flies over. I hope you guys can see in the B-roll how easy it is to load a magazine with this speed loader. So by all means, again, check them out. Don't take my word for it. Go do the research yourself. I just figured I'd show you guys these. Um, it's new on the market. I really like them. 
uh, Yager, the, those guys were really, really cool to talk to when I was down at uh, the Tulsa Gun Show. Took the time just to chit chat and show me their products and tell me all the different features that they have that some of the other products don't. So my question to you is, how do you load your magazines? Do you do it round by round or are you using a speed loader or a, or a tabletop loader? as it is right now. If you have, what are some of the deals that you found? Put them down in the description below. I'd really like to see what you guys are looking at. And that's all I got this time. I really appreciate you guys stopping by. Here comes a high five. You ready? Here we go. If you made it this far in the video, then I'd really appreciate it if you guys would consider subscribing. You can do that right here. Or if you want to check out some other videos that I've got going, check them out right here. If you like the hoodies and shirts that I'm wearing, that's Revolutionary Patriot. I got a link to their website down in the description below with a discount code. And as always, keep on dropping those bells and shells. Thanks, y'all.